Cheers, Louise. How on earth can you, how on earth can you better that? That's what we're fighting for, everybody. That's what we're fighting for. I'm absolutely delighted to bring greetings and solidarity on behalf of the TUC, our 48 unions, five and a half million union members up and down the country. What a fantastic turnout. Look around you, everybody. This is what solidarity looks like, feels like. And I want everybody, because there are half a million workers taking strike action today. Let's hear it for every doctor taking strike action. Every rail worker taking strike action. Every BBC journalist taking strike action. Every civil servant taking strike action. Every university lecturer taking strike action. And if there are any of you here, every teacher taking strike action today. Now, I don't have to tell you what is happening in our schools. We've had a decade of underfunding, understaffing, real terms pay cuts. And Jeremy Hunt has just got up in the House of Commons and he said nothing about funding for public services. He said nothing about funding for schools. And he said nothing about public service pay. Well, let's just send this message loud and clear. A government that doesn't say anything about public sector pay, that doesn't say anything about public services or about schools, is a government that doesn't deserve to be in office. Let's vote them out in the next election. And my final point, my final point is this. This is a government that loves to play divide and rule. Divide and rule between public sector worker and private sector worker. And workers in schools and workers in hospitals. And workers who, li who live, who are born in this country. And workers who travel to live and work in this country. Well, let's say no to their divide and rule. Let's say no to driving wedges between working people. Let's stand together fight together, take action together. That's how we win together, everyone. Thank you.